And when you look back at the charts at Top 40 Radio, you'll see that the, the black women that have been uh, successful with airplay were all of light complexion. That was Beyonce's dad talking about how light-skinned women happen to have ruled the entertainment industry over the years, partly because of their complexion. But Beyonce's mom doesn't seem to be taking the news too well. That is so ridiculous. Is that ridiculous? She doesn't... Plot twist. The woman's ex also revealed that the very complexion that helped the singer stay at the top of the charts was the same thing that made him even get married to her in the first place. Eventually married Tina who was extremely light-skinned. Exactly. So, you know, I began dating either all-white or extremely light-complexion black women. Being in the spotlight of any part of the entertainment industry almost always guarantees fame and fortune, but those things come at a price. A price that is usually in the form of random people picking apart your life just to dig up anything that could harm your image. It seems Beyonce might be the latest celebrity to be paying this price, as the singer happens to be in the headlines for some unexpected claims. Seeing as the woman has millions of fans all over the world fighting for her against the ones that are hell-bent on damaging her image, Beyonce's mom, Tina, has been at the forefront of fighting for her. That's right, Mama Knowles doesn't seem to be having the claims that her daughter has been lightening her skin, because that seems to be all everyone is talking about on social media right now. According to the headlines as of a couple of hours ago, Beyonce seems to be topping the list of virtually every search engine trend. Of course, this is normally a regular Tuesday for the superstar, as everyone knows she has one of the biggest fan bases of anyone in the entire industry. However, her latest appearance in the trend list wasn't about her music. It was about claims that she'd been artificially lightening her skin. While the news wasn't exactly received the best way by many of her fans, some people have just brought up an interview of her dad where he made some rather shocking claims. Matthew Knowles's philosophy, according to his years of experience in the music industry, seems to be that people with lighter skin tones tend to have been the only ones to break out during the early days of R&B and pop music. Of course, that was just one aspect of the entire interview the man gave, but it's been highlighted in connection to the claims people just started making about the Grammy winner. This has led to even more people hopping into the conversation to give their views on it. Unsurprisingly, there are those who have taken Matthew's claims as confirmation of the details already making the rounds about the singer. The other side seems to be packed with members of the Beehive who have been relentless in defending the iconic singer, leading to a major conflict with the Queen Bee herself in the middle. This is pretty much the first time someone like Beyonce has been caught up in something that has shaken the pillars of social media to its core. So you know, this is as big as it gets. Stay tuned to find out all the details and how all of this might connect back to the singer's dad. Show me at Pop Radio the number of black women that were of high complexion and the number of black women that were of dark complexion that got airplay. It almost feels disrespectful having to introduce someone like Beyonce as the iconic singer who broke into the industry when she was just a child, pretty much laid the foundation of what has now morphed into a multifaceted genre of music today. Not only was she a pioneer for several things in the industry, including the types of choreography you'd want to try at home and melodies that inspire people, Beyonce was also the first person to land several awards that had only been open to a single demographic. Just so you know, she is literally IT in the music industry. You'd think attaining a status like that would make her exempt from attacks by fans. But if there's anything social media has proven, it's that anyone with access to the internet can come after even the biggest stars. It was in that spirit that word broke about the singer allegedly lightening her skin over the years in the industry. Per the news, fans seem to be speculating on social media that megastar Beyonce is lightening her skin after recent photos photos show her skin looking unusually whiter than usual. Last weekend, the 42-year-old diva lit up the red carpet for the U.S. premiere of Renaissance, a film by Beyoncé. She sported platinum blonde locks and a silver gown, but social media users were more drawn to her skin tone. Fans on Twitter questioned if the megastar has lightened her skin. One person wrote, caught her ass in 4K now. Y'all got Beyoncé out here bleaching. Look at that foot. You can't bleach the knuckles and knees as good as you can the rest of the body. She bleaching? Another Twitter user wrote, Beyonce looks like a white woman. She's been bleaching and I don't like it. Love the outfit though, bring back the old blonde. 
While quite a few people were talking about how she'd altered her skin color, there were a lot of others who not only didn't believe the claims, but were also calling out the people making the claims in the first place. Claim. One of these people wrote, This has always been Beyonce. Y'all have no idea how color works. The platinum hair color, the silver background, y'all just like to run your mouth just to run it. Yikes. Another user who seemed a lot more upset by the claims wrote, How does it feel to be so stupid? This is what she looked like just a few days ago, so obviously it's the lighting. You're too old to not know how lighting works. A third user wrote, It's like people ain't met black people before. I've seen brown skin people get completely pale ass shit in the winter. Beyonce ain't bleaching no damn skin. Well, seeing as the whole thing already exploded, the spotlight shifted a little from Beyonce to her parents, starting with her dad, who had previously made some unexpected revelations about the relationship between complexion and success in the music industry. Per the reports at the time, Beyonce's dad Matthew Knowles revealed that his daughter's career benefited from skin tone bias while Kelly Rowland suffered. The 71-year-old record executive appeared on an episode of Sirius XM's The Clay Kane Show, where he talked about colorism in the music industry. The black women that have been uh, successful with airplay were all of light complexion. Right, because you had mentioned Mariah Carey, Rihanna, mm -hmm. Nicki. Nicki Minaj, and your kids. He said that he taught a college class that did its own research study in music, which spanned 15 years, and found that light-skinned black women fared better than darker-toned entertainers overwhelmingly, especially in the radio's top 40. Knowles explained, in the music industry, there's still segregation. Programmers, especially at pop radio, have this imagery of what beauty looks like. If you look back even at Whitney Houston, if you look at those photos, how they lightened her to make her look lighter complexioned. I'd say, it's launch. It says others in the book, but. Right. Um, are all light skinned and they all get pushed. Because there's a perception and a colorism. The lighter that you are, the smarter and more economically advantaged. There's a perception all around the world about color. Even with black folks, there's a perception. The study found that artists who benefited included Rihanna, Alicia Keys, Mariah Carey, Nicki Minaj, and of course, Beyonce. He was asked by the host if prejudice toward lighter tones had an impact on the Queen Bey's career, to which Matthew honestly responded, I think she would have had, I think it would have affected her success. Seems that might have even been why the man made the effort to marry someone from a lineage of white people. Anyway. He also gave an instance to prove his point. And I use Kelly Rowland as an example. She's a great example, but you know, the great thing is, Kelly did exceptional outside of America, especially in Australia. Kelly sold over 4 million records, she just got off script. While Matthew's words seem to have given more fuel to the claims about Beyonce, with some people on social media alleging that she'd been lightening her skin just to appeal to the industry. Suffice it to say her mom wasn't having any of it. In an Instagram post shared on Tuesday, Noel said that she had absolutely had it with sad little haters accusing Beyonce of wanting to be white in the wake of the Renaissance movie premiere. I am I'm sick and tired of people attacking her," Knowles wrote of her daughter in a lengthy Instagram statement. Every time she does something that she works her ass off for and is a statement of her work ethic, talent, and resilience. Here, you sad little haters come out the woodwork. Jealousy and racism, sexism, double standards, you perpetuate those things, instead of celebrating a sister or just ignoring if you don't like her. Some experts have said the lighting of the photo was largely responsible for her bright tone. Still, across social media and in some tabloids, many ran with the bleaching theory, claiming that Beyonce looks white or wants to be white. Others questioned her blackness entirely, going so far as to accuse her of hating her black skin. Unfortunately, Beyonce has been on the receiving end of this kind of criticism before, and it doesn't sit well with her mom. In her post, Noel said she was prompted to post after a white TMZ reporter called Beyonce's hairstylist, asking for a comment about the current wave of speculation. Well, that made my blood boil that this white woman felt so entitled to discuss her blackness, Knowles wrote. She added she was particularly saddened that some of her own people continue the stupid narrative with hate and jealousy and called the haters stupid, ignorant, and self-hating. She also noted that Beyonce will likely be upset with her for reacting, but she simply had to post because she was fed up. I am sick of you losers. 
and based on the comments on Knowles's post, so is the Bayhive, as many praised Mama Knowles for sticking up for her daughter. Nonetheless, the fact that her own dad seemed to have researched and reached the conclusion that complexion could alter success. Does that mean if Queen Bay hadn't been light-skinned, she may not have been this successful? Tell me what you think in the comments. That's it for this video. Goodbye.